Continuing our discussion of awe, Rabbi Heschel has a lot to say about awe. He says, forfeit your sense of awe, and the universe becomes a marketplace for you. Now, the whole idea that the universe, as Thomas Aquinas saw it, and as the psalmist saw it, is in fact a place to experience awe, to get inebriated, to get drunk on the amazement of the universe. That is the Jewish and biblical tradition. Uh, unfortunately, uh, we can be dulled, but today's science, today's cosmic story, uh, really begins with awe and arouses awe all over again. It's so easy to fall into taking for granted, and that's the opposite of awe. Uh, we, we, we can be struck anew. In fact, Rabbi Heschel defines wonder that way. He says, wonder is the human mind uh, wrestling with, encountering the wonder of the universe, the awe of the universe. It is the universe itself that speaks to us of awe.